Good afternoon, my fellow Moogoos. To usher in the new year, I'd like to take a few moments to reflect on my top five scammer rants of 2020. I'll try to go from least to most furious. Let's hop right into it. The first scammer was loan scammer Anthony Sheffield. After approximately a month of near constant contact involving hours and hours of phone calls and hundreds if not thousands of text and email exchanges, Anthony finally burst. He went on a rant accusing me of playing games and not being serious. Why did you hang up? You are playing jokes with me. What? What kind of a joke would this even be? This isn't funny because you just sent a blank message again. Every time I ask you to send a message, you keep sending blank messages. I don't understand you. This isn't real, okay? I didn't please, send a please, blank I message. Why would I send a blank message? I send, even... Okay, send, send a picture of you inside your car. Send it to me. Okay, all right. I'm trying. Take a selfie right now. Send me a selfie. Okay, I'll take a selfie and I'll send you the selfie. Yeah, and if this comes out blank, I will end up, I won't pick up your call again. Have a nice day. I don't understand why my messages aren't working. I don't get it. You have to believe me. I'm not... Your messages, your messages are working. Every other message you've been sending, I've been receiving your messages. Again, you sent a blank message, okay? I told you I don't want blank messages. Have a nice day. I didn't... I'm not sending you a blank message. You just did again. You are playing games with me. What the hell is this? Why are you yelling at me? It's not my fault. I'm trying. You are playing games with me. This is not serious. I thought you were a serious person. You are not serious. You are just wasting my time. What? What are you? I think we should get better things to do right now. What are you? I. What are you talking about? Hello, bye. I thought bye. we were friends. Bye, 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 I bye. Said... Please stop You're yelling. Bye. You are playing games. What? What? what are... Hey, be serious about this, okay? This is not time for this, okay? Bye. What are you talking about? I'm not. I'm be... The next rant is from recovery or compensation scammer Detective Collie Richards, having been framed as the perpetrator of a series of cash grabs that were intended to go to loan scammer Anthony Sheffield. He is now mega paranoid about hackers lurking in our email accounts. He expects a payment soon, but gets frustrated when he can't get me, the foolish Mugu that I am, to understand I should not send the payment details to his email. Towards the end of the call, you can hear him slamming something out of anger. Okay, now, um, uh, what are you going to do? What are you going to do concerning this um, uh, problem we are having in uh, okay, I'll get your the... email and every message? I'll... What are you going to do? Right, I'll get... I'll get the card, I'll scratch it off, and I'll send you a picture to your email. No, 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 no. No, don't send me the picture of my email. I told you don't do that. Call the number Why? for me. Don't send it. What? Why? You are asking me why. Yeah. If you send through your e if you send through your email and then Sheffield will get it from your email. Well how would you're you do asking that? me why? How would he do that? Um, Eric, yeah. listen, follow my, instru follow my instruction. Don't send it to me by email. Okay? Send it, yeah, I get it. You want me to send it to your email? Don't send it to me by email. Do not send it by email. Do not. I don't... Why? Why ask me why? I don't understand. The one you sent to email, what happened to it? Didn't didn't you take it? Did, or didn't Anthony Sheffield take it? What happened to it? Why do you have to go buy If I take it, why do you have to go and buy another one? The one you sent to your email, who took it? Oh, right. You know why I told you that? The, so why, why, why telling me you want to send it by email again? Why can't you follow my instruction? I'm sorry. I'm really bad at instructions. I didn't mean to. Yeah, I won't. I won't send it to Anthony Sheffield's email. I'll send it to yours. Don't send it by email. Don't send it by email. Read the number to me. When you buy the card, read the number to me. Call me and read the number to me. Don't send it by email. You want me? You want me to? 
<coughs> you want me to read it off to you over the phone after I send it to you? Do not send it. Do not send it by email, Eric. Do not send it by email. Read it to me. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll just call you and I'll read it off to you if you don't want it sent to the email. That is what I told you. Why are you? Why every time you are, you are trying to make me shout? You are trying to make me. I will tell you once in different times, so many times. I said, don't send it by email. And why are you insisting you want to send it by email? Why? I, I just misunderstood. I'm sorry. This scammer is a bit different than my usual targets. I typically go on the prowl for email scams, but this idiot just happened to fall into my lap. They called me about an apparent legal issue. After nearly an hour on the phone, which involved me having to drive to a convenience store and purchasing gift cards that the scammer claimed he'd credit to me while my social security number was temporarily suspended, he finally lost his cool when he realized he'd just wasted all this time with me. He even insults my mother. Okay, zero four one two one four three zero nine 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 six. And why don't you fuck your mother? What? Why don't you fuck your mother? What? Why, why, why don't you fuck your mother? Does she live with you? Why are you talking like this to me? Do you talk to your mother on Google? What? My my mom's dead. I'm asking you: Is your mom is on Google? A it picture of your mother. Which you can see and send it to me. Uh, why do you need a picture of my mom? Are you trying? To, are you trying to? What? What do you think, man? What are you talking about? I'm trying to get this taken <laughs> care of. I can't go to jail. <laughs> okay, no problem. So, what's the problem? What I say? Fuck yourselves. Bye bye. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> This is yet another rant from recovery scammer Collie Richards. After I went into town to buy a gift card for him, I called him back and informed him I had deposited the money into a specified bank account instead. Collie was appalled that I had apparently been contacted by the hacker again. Whoopsies. Detective, Hello. what is going on? Don't call. Where are you? No, what's the problem? Don't hang up. Never you come, never you come here. I said you are very stupid. Why am I? What are you I talking about? You, you are very, very, very stupid. What? I said you are very, very stupid. You what? are very. Did I? Did I ask you? Did I ask you to send him on the account? Did I ask you that? It looked like you did. I did thought, I ask you to do that? I thought you did. I thought that did was. Did I ask you to do that? You are very. Please, don't you ever. Never you ever called me on the phone again, Eric. What? Don't you ever call me on the phone again. You are very, very stupid. Don't you ever call me on the phone again, what? Eric. The, the, okay? What, what, what is the problem? And finally, we have gold shipment scammer Quezzy Sarpong. After a month or so of being strung along, Quezzy finally thought he was going to get his payout of just shy of $63,000. Yes, you heard that correct. I'd taken out a loan to pay the invoice to have the gold shipped to me, and on payday, I called Quezzy from the bank to facilitate the transfer. While I went into the back with my lawyer to finish up some last-minute paperwork, Quezzy spoke with the clerk, who was also the manager. His name? Mr. Ibuka, who is actually a friend of mine posing as a scammer that works at the bank. He proceeds to take the vast majority of the money, only offering to send $96 to Quezzy. When I finally got back into the lobby and onto the phone, this was what Quezzy had to say to me. Note that he's a bit hard to understand at times, but you can hear the white-hot rage emanating from his vocal cords as he rants up a typhoon of fury. Hey, hey Quezzy, it's Eric. Eric, Eric, please, um, listen to me, listen to me. I don't know whatever you're doing, and I don't really understand what you are doing. Uh -huh. Number one, I think um, whatever I'm doing with you, it seems I'm, I'm, I, before you do it, you don't make any, <clears throat> stop that that you're making to me for today. I do, uh, listen to me. Listen to me and listen very quickly. Don't make a transfer to me. Because if you make any transfer to me, you, you, it's not going to work out for you. Because I, I, I need to rethink about the transaction I'm doing with you. For today, cancel that transfer. For today. Don't make any transfer to me today. Don't make any transfer to the shipping company today. I'll call them right now. Cancel it for now. 
I will give you further instruction on what to do. If I need you to do it, you do it. If not, you not do anything. What okay? do you mean? Because if you do it, I'm not going to accept it. I'm telling you, stop the transfer to Derek. I already sent it. I'm this money, you're not picking the call. I you already sent it. Thank yes. God. Listen to me, you're not sending anything. Nobody has received anything. Nobody should play game on you. That thing you are doing is nonsense and rubbish, Eric. Don't tell me you are making any transfer. If you are paying any money to somebody, don't tell me you are paid money to somebody to make a transfer. Okay. I told you to be careful, but you are not listening to me. What's the problem? What? What? what I, already, the, I already sent the money. You the, don't what? send nothing. Wait, get this, get, what, what money did you send? The, Is that how they make transfer? For, 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 for me to be receiving call, am I supposed to receive call? Did I give you an account? Is it my account? Man, who are you making the transfer to Eric? I, I sent it to Did the I shipping. Did I account to make a transfer? Listen to me. Don't tell what you're not supposed to tell me. I, why are you don't yelling me at me? Why are you I'm yelling? I'm with you. I'm... I'm a lawyer. Don't tell me that. You did, you, did I, you, you are making transfer. I'm, I've been calling you since morning. Won't you take instruction from me before you do anything? It's the... I said to my... you. This is the second time. How much did you pay before you make this transfer today? How much did you pay? Tell me. 62, How much have you paid today before you made this transfer? $62,896. That was the invoice amount. I did the bank transfer. Oh, oh you made the you, you, you transfer to who? Eric. To DSSC. You have been scammed again. You have been scammed again. I'm telling you, I'm annoyed with you. Don't tell me that. How did you, where, where did you get the money? Is it the person that is calling me that gave you the money? It was a loan. Who gave you the money that transferred it? I got the loan, the and I, I got the loan through my bank, oh. First Republic Bank. Then why can't you transfer that from me? Why can't you transfer that from your bank? Is that your bank? Who is that talking to me? I'm annoyed. It's my bank. It's my bank. I I'm got the loan. I, I'm highly disappointed. Listen, you, you have lost your money again. I'm disappointed in you. What, what, are, you, what are you telling me? No, no, no. Listen to me. I got the bank to give me a loan, and then I had well, the loan. Okay. Where listen, is the payment listen slip? to me. Where is the payment, where, where is the, where is the payment slip, Eric? Where is the payment slip? Uh, he shredded it. The clerk, sh here, you know what? Did you what? Mr. Abuka, I don't know what's going on here. Can you talk to him? I don't know what's going on oh, here. Oh, this man, this man, this, this. Well, that's it, folks. Have a safe and happy New Year's. If this video brought you joy or laughter, please share it around.